Hi guys, this is Aisha from Web Maintenance US and today I'm going to show you how to set up your corporate email on your device. Uh, so the first thing what you're going to do is you're going to click that long link that I sent you or you can open your browser and type in bluehost.com forward slash webmail. Either one of these links will work. So once you open the link, First, what you're going to do, you're going to type your email address that I sent you, and I'm going to type Aisha at Elite Web Designer US dot com. Then you're going to put your password, the one I sent you, and then you're going to click login. You can save the password or not on your device. It's up to you. I recommend you to save it. So this is the window that's going to open before you uh, you can access your mailbox. You can click the open blue button and get into your mailbox or you can scroll down to a section set up your email on your device and we're going to click automatically configure my device. So the first the first uh, item in this list under application is going to be the device that you are using iOS for iPhone iPad so here you can see protocols so we're going to click on the on the link of the protocols on the first line of the application and then this window will pop up and we're going to click proceed and then we're going to click allow profile downloaded says review the profile in settings app if you want to install it so that's what we're going to do next we're going to go to settings and we're going to type on the top profile and the first link that pops up says vpn and device management so we're going to go here and automatically you're going to be able to see here in downloaded profile it says aisha at EliteWebDesignersUS.com. We're going to click on this one. It says verified. So on the right top corner, it says install. Going to click install. It will ask your screen passcode for the device if you're using uh, the device with a passcode. And then it's going to open install on the bottom. We're going to click install. And now it is asking the password for that email, the corporate email that we created. So for me specifically, I will enter the password for Aisha at EliteWebDesignerUS.com. We're going to enter that password here. And I'm going to click Next. Right, once here the password is entered, we're going to click Done in the right top corner. And it says Configuration Profile is complete. So we're going to go back to the mail app, going to refresh the page, and we see here Aisha at EliteWebDesignerUS.com as the corporate email in the mail app.